hi guys welcome to my channel it is your girl jada jone and i am back with another video and today i'm going to be showing y'all this gorgeous wig that i got from uni's hair this is a 28 inch body wave hair i just feel like well wig <laughs> i feel like this is the perfect length perfect texture to get all the layers and thickness and fullness that you want but i'm not gonna ramble too much y'all i really give a thumbs up to this hair the lace was bomb and it did everything i needed to do so if you guys want to see how i got this look stay tuned for the video okay guys so starting out with my ball cap this is going to be more so just a run through of the install i just really want to hoop and holla about how much i love this hair this hair is so so great and so soft um but the lace as you see is pretty good and thin like when it's over my skin you can barely see it i'm gonna go in with my alcohol if y'all don't already know how i do my ball cap method i use arrogant taze method with ghost bond i feel like it's way better than using the got to be spray but yes that's what i'm doing um cleaning off the surface of my skin to make sure that i have no glue or excess makeup or anything oils all of that so it can adhere properly so before i glue the lace down i like to cut it up into three or four sections pull it back and then i'm gonna go with my ghost mon xl and put it all over smooth it out with a comb or popsicle stick or anything and i'm gonna do two or three layers and then get ready to lay my lace down dries clear you want to place the wig completely into the glue and you want to press down with your fingers or with a comb making sure that the glue is adhering to the lace and it is melting into your skin this particular wig i didn't really have to cut any ear tabs it fit perfectly on my head which was a plus um but yeah i'm just laying the wig into the glue and you want to make sure that you put it in when the glue turns clear so that it doesn't come up or it's not too dry. So sometimes I like to spray a little got to be just to make sure that it's staying all the way completely in if you get what I'm saying. Um, so now I'm going to go in with a elastic band and the elastic band makes sure that the lace is melted into your skin and it's going to make it look like a scalp. decide your part okay y'all i know y'all been asking for me to show the construction my bad i need to get better with that because i know i haven't been showing y'all but showing the construction is basically sewing the inside so y'all can see how it's in one thing i will tell y'all that most wigs lately have been coming with only one inch of parting space on the sides and five inches in the middle so keep that in mind around the time now you're probably going to be ordering 13 by fives but well 13 by sixes but technically you're only getting one inch of parting space so if you were to do a side part you won't be able to do a, a deep side part um and a lot of companies will trick you and make you think that but make sure you watch current reviews and you also scroll to the last picture on the website to see how much parting space you will get because it shows you um and almost all of the weeks that i've gotten since like november have had like this closure type of thing so just a heads up for you guys um it's deep parting in the middle, but on the sides, it's like one inch. So I'm just hot combing, and y'all see that I over bleached a little bit. I'm gonna show y'all my trick for when I over bleach my knots. What I like to do, 
but right now I'm gonna go ahead and cut that lace off and start melting it even more. To make my parts perfect, first I go in with some concealer and conceal the part. And now you're going to see me go in. And this looks like mascara, but it's actually a root touch-up brush that I got from the hair store. And all I'm going to do is go in and twirl it in a circle and close that part up a little bit. And also get those knots back or get that hair back black where I over bleach. Um, and basically, you don't want too wide of a part, but you don't want too thin of a part. You want the perfect part just so it looks natural. So sometimes I'll go in with this or I'll even go in with a permanent marker and it helps too. Anything that's black and dark enough to match the hair is going to help cover up and close that part back in. So if y'all can see what I'm doing, um, that's what I like to do to close my part up. And I even go with permanent marker, like I said, that's what I'm doing right here to make it perfect because a perfect part is just brings the wig all together. So that's what I'm doing right here. And y'all, this hair is gorgeous, y'all. You can just tell like how fluffy it is just from being blow dry right there. If I would have flat ironed this hair, if I would have flat ironed this hair, y'all, it it it, it would have been perfect. Like I was contemplating flat ironing or curling, but I was like, let me curl, let me get that thick curl look. Um, and y'all, it's just so gorgeous. I was putting serum in. Now I'm going to go to the baby hairs. Y'all pretty much know how I get down with the baby hairs. If y'all want an in-depth tutorial, let me know. But really, my method is cut, pluck, and cut. Well, cut, pluck, <laughs> and curl, and swoop. So, yeah. This hair curled so easily i had no issues y'all know i use my babyless pro titanium curler and this is kind of like a marcel iron type curler just in case you guys were looking for it i'll try to find a link but it's been hard for me to find a link lately but yeah this is my favorite curling iron all i do is use it like a wine curler and wrap my hair around it and i get the best curls the most voluminous curls ever y'all this looks super flawless it looks like i went to the hair salon or something but yeah this is a finished product um i'm gonna get all cute and stuff and show y'all the finished look but as far as i'm concerned this is so easy and it looks so gorgeous so natural so pretty and this is like one of my signature looks so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys are down to shop with unis they are a great company good lace and good hair i, I thank you guys for watching this video Stay tuned for more and I will see you guys in the next one.